Today we will be talking about a product, Cheetos Slamming Hot Crunchy Cheese Flavored Snacks. Net weight's eight and a half ounces, 240.9 grams. Here are the nutrition facts. Cheetos, connect the Chester Cheetah. All right, these are a really good snack. Just be careful how much you eat of these. Just eat them in very small portions. Because when you eat these, your stomach will start, you'll get start getting a tummy ache. Not only that, but the spice stays in your mouth after you eat these. They're good, just don't eat them all at once. And then you won't have any problems with your stomach. Because if you don't, if you eat, if you're not careful about you eat of these, you'll get a stomach ulcer. Which is a sore that develops in the lining of the esophagus, stomach, or small intestine. Some people have eaten these and I, I, I searched it online. Some people have eat, ate these and they end up throwing up with blood coming out. So be careful how much these you eat. <clears throat> That's why I don't eat these all the time. Just eat them in very small portions, you'll be perfectly fine. But your stomach will thank you in the end. The stomach will thank you for not eating all these at once. Or at least try and stay away from these so you don't have any stomach so you don't have a stomach ache. Here are some facts about Flamin' Hot Cheetos. One, they were created by a janitor. Former Frito-Lay janitor Richard Montanez came up with the idea of Fleming Hot Cheetos after taking a batch home with him from work. He was inspired by the Mexican street food called Elote and sprinkled chili powder on them. He must have been very confident. And how finger licking good this upgrade was because he arranged a meeting with the CEO of the entire company to pitch the idea. Now Montana's is an executive president of free to and free to lay. Two, they might be addicting. We often say that we're addicted to our food, favorite foods and drinks, but Flamin' Hot Cheetos are rumored to actually have addictive qualities in their ingredients. Medical professionals have compared it to mild opiate addiction. The burning sensation we get from the peppers and hot Cheetos causes a release of natural op opioids, endorphins in our bodies. That it makes us feel good, at least until the opioid is gone. Then, and then we feel the need to eat more. Three, the serving size is very inaccurate. You know, and how it, you know how in some bags of chips, it seems like you're getting half air, half snack? Well, Cheetos doesn't play that game. The serving size in the bag states that there are about 189 chips, but it turns out there are closer to 237.5 chips per bag. Not so that's worth complaining. Four, they're allowed. They're four. They're not allowed in some schools. Why? See, a few years ago, schools in California, New Mexico, and Illinois decided to ban the snack from on-campus consumption. Its lack of nutritional value was the main reason the schools labeled Flamin' Hot Cheetos contraband, but kids were also eating way more than the recommended portion amount. And the whole addictive thing didn't really help either. Five, they've been behind some serious health scares. These che these Cheeto these Flamin' Hot Cheetos have been the reason for a lot of hospital visits. People who eat large amounts of Flamin' Hot Cheetos have had chest and stomach pains, as well as their poop turning red from the dye. Six, the spiciness is a mystery. What makes these Cheetos Fleming Hot is as much of a secret as the Krabby Patty formula. The public has no idea what combination of spices is used in the recipe. The bag lists Flamin' Hot seasoning as an ingredient, but the maltodextrin and it doesn't give us much insight into the spicy factor that the world may never know. Seven, they can be eaten in many ways. You don't have to limit yourself to just enjoying Flamin' Hot Cheetos straight from the bag. 
People have taken this snack, food, and used it to enhance everyday foods. I'm talking of anything from Cheeto Ritos to hot Cheetos, spicy treats, even restaurants are trying to incorporate this snack in their dishes. I hope you enjoy this product and eat very small portions of this, and your stomach will, th will thank you. I hope you enjoy this product. Have a great day.